Tyler, how'd you uh, evaluate your first start back up here? Uh, I wouldn't say it was terrible. Um, obviously, three solo shots. Um, Wando Suna, bad pitch. And then just tip your cap to Rosario and Olsen. Um, thought it seemed like uh, the one Olsen sitting on it was in the bottom away quadrant. Uh, hit it well. And then uh, Rosario just uh, too close to him. Uh, besides that, filling up the zone, um, and yeah, attacking hitters, a couple walks, but um, was able to stop the, the damage and then obviously get into the seventh, so yeah. Those first three innings were about as crisp, crisp as we've seen you. What, when you look at, at that part of the game, did you do particularly well? Uh, just getting ahead of hitters, honestly. Uh, getting to two strikes, yeah, really quick. Um, and then making quality pitches with two strikes. Um, felt like I did that throughout the whole outing, obviously in the, I think the fifth. Started getting behind a couple hitters, uh, but managed to get back into good counts and then, yeah, get out of it. Is there anything that you improved on or fixed while you were in the minors that will help you here? Um, yeah, just understanding my, my strengths and pitching to my strengths. Um, picked up a sinker, uh, so threw a lot today. Uh, started running into right-handers. Um, yeah, besides that, I feel like I got my slider back finally. I had some really good sliders. Uh, and, yeah, just continue to keep filling it up, um, get ahead early, and then let the, the rest take, take part. As far as pitching to your strengths, what, what does that mean uh, in practice, in reality? Uh, getting ahead with the heater and then um, sliders off it. And then obviously everything else opens up if I'm ahead. So um, I feel like I did that really well today. Uh, later in the game, was getting behind with the sinker. But, you know, like I said, managed to get back into counts. Um, and yeah, overall... I don't think it was terrible. Obviously, you just tip your cap, home runs. But felt like, you know, got into the seventh. I haven't been in the seventh in a while. Um, Majority is five innings or yeah, even less. But uh, I feel like I, I did a, a good job, obviously. Like I said, I tipped cap, homers, the chances of that happening. But, yeah. Who would you pick up the sinker from? Uh, Grayson over there and uh, Vassal. Who in Vassal? Mike Vassal. Who, who did you say before, Vassal? Grayson Crawford, Triple A oh, pitching coach. Yeah, yeah. how, how do you just view this opportunity after a month away, just being back here um, with a chance in the number five spot in the rotation? Yeah, I mean, obviously we're on a really good stretch. We're playing really good baseball. Um, you want to come out, you want to compete, you want to help the, the team win, and, you know, give them an opportunity to win, go deep in the games, and um, keep the damage down. So, you know, just got to go back out. Keep filling up the zone, keep competing, um, let the rest take take part. With the sinker, is, is the, was the purpose of adding that to your repertoire for more grounders, to lose more grounders, or just to set another pitch up? Yeah, um, more more grounders and more so not allowing right-handers to get comfortable and lean over. Um, that's probably the biggest thing. So the majority would sit on the glove side, and all my damage was on the glove side. So the sinker kind of, you know, equalizes that and allows them to stay pretty balanced and uh, not really try to lean over. So opens up a lot more of the outer half for me.